Roadway lines, fences, and barriers will now follow the elevation change of the road. So in this scene, we have a curved roadway that slopes up, and we're going to add some advanced lines to this sloped road. So I'll go to a top view, and I can see my points in the center of the roadway. And I'll use my advanced line types, and we're going to select the center line and a dashed white line. We can then customize our line type to match this particular roadway. And I'm also going to add a Z factor um, so that just because these line types are flat, it'll just bump up a 0 0.05 above the picked position. So we're going to use an arc and we'll just follow the roadway around the curve. So now we'll add a couple more um, dashed lines to the roadway. Once again we're going to use the arc with a second point to just fine tune that position. We want to make sure we're snapping to the points. And lastly, there was just a yellow line on the side here. So I'm going to add a single solid yellow line. Now we can just orbit in our scene and you can see that those lines followed that uh, the slope of the roadway snapping to the points and I'll turn the layer back on for the pavement and we can see that the line work falls directly on that surface and follows the elevation changes.